So I took a few minutes and I fit the uh, that new handle to the pass around knife. I'm uh, we're going to my grandmother's for Easter dinner tomorrow, and I thought it'd be nice to carve our Easter ham with uh, the new knife. So I wanted to put a, a nice handle on it. It's just joined with beeswax. I took the beeswax and I put a little bit of uh, black crayon in there. It's temporary. It's not even. It doesn't even have a tight fit. It's just in there. I mean, it's not coming out, but I mean a precision fit versus a tight fit. Um, there we go. You can see there. See, there's a few gaps. I'm not worried about that. I may actually send it out to you guys that way with the new handle. I haven't decided yet. Um, I'm not worried about fit and finish to a T for this knife temporarily. Um, the balance point is really nice. It balances right about there, which is where it went on another knife, even with the handle so far back. Um, yeah, there you see. It feels a lot more substantial. A lot of my knives are very light weight, and uh, I actually made this blade a little bit thicker through. You see the choil there? And the edge doesn't actually stop there where you see it stop. It continues on down. There's a, a slight curve in it. Let me see. Yeah, you can't. There you go. There's a slight curve in it that actually disappears. So. Ah, uh, this focus thing is driving me nuts. There you go. No. Nope. Anyway, um. There you are. It, it goes to a zero edge. I mean, there's no. That's the edge bevel on this thing. So, and just for the record for you guys, let me see if I can actually illustrate this. When I sharpen, that's the angle I sharpen at. So that you can see, we had talked about this previously. I put it about halfway up my thumb, a little higher than halfway up my thumb, set the bevel, and that's, that's where I set my edge bevels. But anyhow, there you go. The slide in here does not do this wood justice at all all but yep so there we go the pass around knife with robert's handle for his kogyoto for me to use for my easter dinner <laughs>